All new at 6, a Metro police officer accused of bribery. DeKalb County's police chief launched an internal investigation after complaints one of his officers allegedly demanded money from people he suspected were smoking pot. Penalties. Dave Huddleston is live outside the DeKalb Police Headquarters with where the investigation stands right now. Dave. Yeah, John, I talked to the DeKalb County Police Chief, and he says once they started this extensive internal investigation, Officer Brandon Brown, on the force for almost three years, resigned. Why? Take another look at this cell phone video. Through an open records request, Channel 2 Action News received a copy of this cell phone video shot August 6th. It allegedly shows DeKalb County Police Officer Brandon Brown. Police say instead of giving a ticket to a group he suspected was smoking pot, he demanded they give him cash. This police internal affairs report says Brown was working off-duty at Meskarim Ethiopian restaurant. Now, according to the internal investigation, Officer Brown was sitting on this patio when one of the employees came out and told him that someone inside was smoking marijuana. That's when the report says he went in there and asked for 50 bucks. The internal report says Brown told the group in addition to the ticket there will be a $500 fine. He's then accused of saying, okay, if you want me to look out for you, I don't mind, but do realize nothing is free. Once outside the restaurant, you can see the uniformed officer with money in his hand. Then he realizes he's being recorded. We wanted to reach out to Brandon Brown, but no one answered. For 50 lousy bucks. DeKalb Police Chief Cedric Alexander says once confronted with the evidence, Brown resigned. Channel 2 Action News got a copy of Brown's resignation letter. This is officer that went uh, off the rails, uh, left the grid and uh, didn't uphold the integrity of the office in which he was sworn to do. Now, in the last 90 minutes, I checked with the district attorney's office, and they said they have a copy of this internal investigation, and they are reviewing it for possible criminal charges. Reporting live in DeKalb County, Dave Huddleston, Channel 2 Action News. As the chief said, all over $50. In February.